Welcome to Healthy Fit Happy Mom Disc 3. Now you've had your baby, you're getting back into shape, now it's time to kick into high gear. You've seen me go through my pregnancy, now my baby is just turned seven months old, and Devin is actually 13 weeks pregnant, so she's on to number two. Yeah. So she'll be showing us some modifications along the way. For now, let's get into the warm up. Welcome to Healthy, Fit, Happy Mom, Disc 3. You've had your baby now, you're getting back into shape, now we're gonna really kick it into high gear with an hour workout. We're gonna start off with a warm up. Okay, we're gonna do a dynamic hamstring stretch. Mm -hmm. So, legs are straight, back is flat, you step to one side, hands come to either side of the foot, step together. Good. This is great. So you're gonna get a little bit warmer with each one, go a little bit farther down but just let your body dictate that. You wanna have a flat back here, extend through your head. And don't overextend your knees here. You wanna have a slight bend to your knee too to protect them. Exactly. A little cushion. A little cushion. <sighs> Breathe through this. You should feel a really nice stretch here through your leg. Make sure you're trying to exhale on the way up. It's always the hardest part of the movement is when you need your exhale. Dynamic stretches are really wonderful ways to get your body prepped for the workout ahead. Exactly. Let's do two more. One more. Good. Okay, go ahead and roll over your mat. We're gonna need a little bit of cushion for your knee here. Okay, we're gonna take crescent pose. Inhale, reach your arms up. Good, clasp your hands and press towards the ceiling. Good, now lift. With a tight belly, go back just a little bit. Good. Reach up, all the way over. Low lunge. So now we take your left arm and reach up to a twist. Very nice. Come on down. Now this is when we need a little help on the knee here. So this is a psoas and quad stretch. Mm -hmm. Lift up out of it, reach back, grab your ankle. Now you can either stay here if you're a little more flexible, pull it in. Play with it. Now remember, you're not fully warmed up just yet, so don't push yourself too hard. Exactly. And it's totally fine to stay right here if you're feeling the stretch. This is your hip and your quad, so you don't need to go as drastically into it. And make sure your knee doesn't extend farther than your toes exactly. here. You really just want just ease into it, mm -hmm. right? Exactly. Good. Now go ahead and release that. To switch, we're just going to jump to the other side. Or step. Or step. Either way. Reach up. Clasp your hands. Exhale. Up and back. Make sure no matter what, your belly's tight here. As soon as you let it go, it dumps into your lower back. Good. All the way down, low lunge. Take your opposite arm, reach up. Twist, twist. Good. All the way down. Drop your back knee. Reach up. Out of it, bend, good, and pull it in. Just use your discretion here. Mm -hmm. Whatever your body's allowing you to do, go ahead and do it. Yeah, you can play with it, you know, have it be dynamic. You can pull it forward, kind of pull it back. Exactly. Let's do a few cat and cow stretches just to get the spine opening up. So inhale, arch your back and look up. Exhale, round. Really pull through the belly here. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Take two more. Inhale. I love this one. This feels so good. Exhale. This is a great move to do anytime, anywhere. You know, you and your baby can be in the same room together. He or she can be playing on the ground and just do a couple of these. Good. Let's do the last one. Exhale. Let's just sit back in child's pose just for a moment. Bring your forehead to the mat. Just take a deep inhale. <sighs> Exhale and just let your body sink a little farther down. One more. <sighs> and go ahead and roll all the way up out of it. So good. Good. All right. All right, let's get to the workout now. 